Okay, so more double sleeve. Um, looking at just continuing on, we had the inversion sweep, and um, when they were um, squatting down from that position, then we're going to look if, if Matthew backs away. So we were playing our, our spider hook. Um, I was going to kick him in the butt, but then Matthew went into this cut cross pass. So we were looking at this transition into a reverse de la Hiva. The reverse de la Hiva stops Matthew getting the knee slice, stops him getting his knee to the mat. So we looked about if his head was forward, I could go for that inversion sweep where I would be kicking him here and dropping him down. And now from there, I'm coming up, taking my leg out and wanting that underhook. Um, we also looked at um, from our same position, he goes for that knee slice. I went for the reverse of the heave out, but now he squats down. So now that inversion isn't going to happen. I would still kick him up to get a reaction, and then from there I'm just putting him straight down. And again, we talked about finding that leg so he doesn't um, put the reverse de la Hiva hook in. And now from our position, I'm coming up, and I can make sure that that's not connected. And now from there, I'm straight into my knee slice. Another reaction Matthew may do, especially if he goes for the first one, is same thing, that spider hook. My foot's here, I'm trying to kick him forward. He comes in and then he decides to back out. If he can't, um, one more time, if he can't um, get his knee to the mat because of my reverse deli, he a hook, he knows if he stays here, he's getting a sweat. So he backs out. The minute he backs out, I don't need that reverse deli, he hook anymore. I just take it out and put my foot on his hip. Even if he's got a grip on my pants here. Now, if there's a bend in the leg, all I'm going to do is take my spider hook out. Again, notice the way my right foot is the distance maker. I can just kick that off, turn around and put in the strong De La Hiva hook. And then from there we looked at that backwards um, um, off balance sweep from the De La Hiva position where I can kind of bring in my knee shield and just kick to put him down. Once I'm in that position, I'm withdrawing my leg, looking for the underhook and I'm straight into the knee slice. Let's just get my angle on that. So, from our spider hook position, I'm looking to kick him forward. He drives into that knee slice, then he backs off. The minute he backs off, my grips stay the same. This is the beauty about double sleeve. You know, it's not complicated grip switching. So that hook comes out, foot comes in the hoop, in the hip, and now if there's a bend in that leg, I just break its grip, come around, put in that strong de la Hiva hook, turn into my knee shield position, and now I'm just bringing him over to here. Once I have that, again, I don't want him coming up on an elbow, so I'm keeping that tight. Withdraw my leg, win the underhook, and we are straight into our cut cross pass. That's pathway one. Sometimes, though, when we're in our position, I have the spider hook in, he goes for the knee slice when he backs off, and I'm here. The minute I break his grip, if Matthew's right leg, there's not a bend in it, when I turn around, it can be hard to get the profile of the hook. So I've noticed there's no bend in it, I'm on my right hip. I'm gonna pendulum all the way around to my left hip and I thread in a deep Dalahiva hook. Second foot comes in like a butterfly hook and then I just sit up and I've locked in Dela X. So obviously I can sweep them in two directions. The same sweep, I just circle him this way and put him down. Again, controlling that elbow so he doesn't pull it back. And once I withdraw that leg, I'm looking for the underhook straight into my pass. More angle on that just there. So from our position, I go to kick him in the butt, he goes for his knee slice, he backs off, foots on the hip, I'm gonna chop that all the way through. Della X is such a strong position with double sleeve. So I can come up, maybe I try to um Sweep him this road, if Matthew's leaning that way, I'm just taking him that way. Very much like our, our, our sweep that we did in the Dell X. So again, from that position, I'm holding on to this. Windshield wiper my bottom leg out. As I come up, I'm into that knee slice. Turn my hip back. Wind side control. Let's more angle on that. So, from our spider hook position, my reverse Del Hiva hook in, I can come all the way around, lock in Del X, and now I can just take them over. So again, it's just a variation of the tilt sweep that we did in the Del X system, only with double sleeve. I don't want them coming up, so I'm pulling that 
And now from my windshield wiper, my bottom leg out. From there, as I come up, build the base to my knee. Knee slice is coming over. I let go of the sleeve on the underhook. And now we are into side control. So that is, um, if he backs away, we're just looking for Della Heva or Della X.